Welcome everyone to Coffee with the President. We're here in right outside of Chicago, one of the northwest suburbs um, at Harper College. And it is, it is my absolute pleasure. We've been spending a lot of time together. Mm -hmm. I'm here with the president of Harper College, Dr. Avis Proctor. Thank you for having some coffee. Thank you. I'm glad you're here. Yeah, yeah. this is such like the community that you have built here, it is um it's palpable. It is so student-centric and um it's just been an awesome week you gotta watch the episode of the college tour here it's fantastic and <laughs> everyone's here is awesome where do we start with this let's start off with um what are you most proud of the students here or how do you even describe the students to your family and friends out there we have students from all backgrounds of all ages our last uh commencement ceremony we had a graduate who is 99 years old. So, oh my gosh, that's uh, awesome. If you're looking to pursue higher education at Harper, we're here for you. <laughs> it's so great. It's so great. And then um, recently, you all won, or not too well, oh, you won a big scholarship. You want to talk about that? Yeah, so we were blessed to receive an $18 million gift from uh, Mackenzie Scott. And uh, we were able to put that to good use to ignite paths to success that's the name of the scholarship and we also um, are um, funding community innovation grants to nonprofits in our district that can meet the needs of um, different organizations to help students and community members uh, with economic mobility and they have to have a, a lens of equity and diversity as well so really giving back to the community, not just here at Harper, but also our 23 communities we serve. It's, it's so awesome because I mean, I've heard it from you, I've heard it from many people here. It's like, we are the community's college. Absolutely, we work with our high school districts, we work with bus the business community, we work with university partners, really trying to cultivate educational opportunities for students uh, and for them to thrive and meet their academic and career goals. And so um, our faculty and staff are caring, they're dedicated, they're talented, and really oh, we're truly proud of the student-centered uh, approach that we take here at Harper. What motivates you? I've been, you know, not to say I was like, I was, I was stalking the back of all the stuff, <laughs> your, all your accomplishments, and, <laughs> and, and we've been hanging out for probably an hour before even recording this and just like, your passion, your excitement, where does that come from? Well, uh, it's personal. I am a first generation college student and uh, I know the power of education and what it can do for individuals. And I have a personal testimony of that. And so I'd like to replicate that with each and every one of our students. And so we're intentional about how we design our academic programs, the student experience here, uh, it's actually our You Matter, We Care, SOAR framework for the student experience. So that having impact on students, not only them, but their families and for generations. That's the uh, thing that keeps me going and motivates me to continue this great work here at Harper. It's so awesome. Where yesterday we were filming a student and what was really so nice about it, the student showed up with her whole family. Oh. Her parents were here. I think one of the <laughs> grandparents were here. We were all discussing it today of just like, that shows you what a family this is and that everyone's behind and knowing like what this young student is doing and going to college, what it means for the whole family. Yes, we are focused on removing barriers and so, um, and putting supports in place. So be it supports here at the college and actually we engage families. We, we actually have, a PASO program uh, that our families of Hispanic descent can come and understand uh, what it is that we have to offer. And, um, you know, through all of our programming, we think about the student and the impact of them and their families and uh, planning out what it is that they want to pursue and, and make sure they're aware of all the opportunities we have for them. I love it. So great. So <laughs> let's talk a bit about the future. What is, what, 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 what plans, what's, what's next? We are proud of the excellent academic programs we have, but we're not satisfied with just staying with what we have. We're looking to build more. And so uh, staying at the uh, uh, top of our game in terms of innovation and academic programming. So aviation maintenance is a new program that we're going to be bringing forward. There's high demand uh, for that. Um, information technology, cybersecurity, Artificial intelligence. A lot of folks are talking about AI nowadays. Uh, it seems and to be so a topic. <laughs> it is. And we're not just talking about it. We're yeah. actually offering 
classes in it to equip individuals in our community to understand what it's about and how they can use it for good. And so uh, just staying at the top of our game in terms of what we offer, make sure it's relevant and meets the need of our area employers. We work directly with them and we make sure that there are opportunities with, um, for example, our apprenticeship program, uh, earn and learn model. So employers that want to help their employees upskill, uh, they will pay for them to go to school, and but also carve out a schedule for them to come and take classes and earn a credential with us while working. Uh I love that so much that we're, you're going to learn about a story just like this in the episode. <laughs> oh. Yeah, it's a great story. It, it, it's so great because it's like, while she's learning, she's earning. That's right. And it's a really nice model and already kind of set up with a job right after. So it's and just, graduating uh, yeah, debt free. And debt free. Yeah. It's amazing. Yeah. 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 Very intentional about the work that we do. That's awesome. Is there, what, what question have I not asked you that I should have, I should ask you? Oh, that's a good one. Uh, <laughs> let's see. You know, many people come onto campus and they actually wonder, is this a four-year college? And uh, I, we're a community college. And as I always emphasize, we're the community's college. But uh, we also have a university center. And so we partner with uh, universities across the state. We have um, university partnerships in terms of articulation agreements outside of the state as well. But uh, our four partners right now, NIU, SIU down south, uh, we have DePaul, uh, you know, DePaul University and Roosevelt University. And so individuals can come here on our campus or online, of course, um, and we remove that geographical barrier. Again, we talk about removing barriers. Mm -hmm. And so not having to go down south to Carbondale or out west to DeKalb or into the city, navigating traffic, you have a family, we're thinking about the whole student and how do we remove a barrier so that they can get access and accelerate completing those credentials. So our university center is something I think we should highlight as well. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Well, listen, anything else we want to say to the audience? Who's, oh, let me ask you one final question. Who's a good fit here? We're here for everyone. As, as I mentioned, <laughs> you did start the conversation yeah, up with a 99 year old exactly. graduate. We have teenagers that are taking mm. dual credit and earning credentials uh, while they're in high school. Uh, and so the whole spectrum, we're here to meet students where they are, remove barriers and help them excel and realize their dreams. So choose Harper, you don't go wrong. And we're ready to see you soar like a hawk. Yeah, oh, so great. Go Hawks. Go Hawks. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you for what you're doing for this community. Thank you for what you're doing for this country and the, and the world. It's, it's like it's like it starts here and how that has such a positive effect on this planet. It's um it's really great. And it's Absolutely. an honor to spend time with you. It's an honor to see what's happening on this campus. Thanks so much. Yeah. Cheers, everyone. Cheers.